here coming at you with another episode of Instant Noodle Recipe Time. This is the show where I show you what to do with your instant noodles. And today we've got one that's going to have a mukbang. Hey, this is a uh, Fireball Stir Fried Ramen. Not just spicy, that's what it says. Not just spicy. Where is it? Yeah, right there. Not just spicy. So. What else is it? It's supposed to look spicy at least. Um, just making sure it's four minutes, correct? Four minutes. And then it wants 120 mils of, uh, what do you call it? Yeah, 120 mils of what do you call it? Water. Reserve. Eight spoons. Eight spoons is 120 mils. There you go. And is it? Okay, flakes go in at the end. All right, so here is our noodle block going in and turning on, tuning in and dropping out. Yeah, so I have no, no idea what to expect here. I kind of have an inkling that this is by the same folks who make the bull ramen. I'm rather hoping not, but we'll see. Um, where is my glug cup? I'll need to measure 120 mils. Where's my glug cup? Um, oh, come on. Where is it? I need that. be going, ramen reader, what the heck is a glug cup? And uh, that's just what I call it. It's this. It's a, uh, it's a baby bottle. But the baby bottle is in measurements that are milliliters, which is great because this needs 120 and it measures that amount on the side. However, it is hard to read these days. Ah, I need a different one. That's not spouty. Oh, come on. I don't have one of those. There's one. That'll work. See, it's got a lip. I need the lip. But yeah, 120 mils is about a half a cup, and I've heard people get all sorts of rowdy about this when uh, spicy varieties call for reserved water to be added back in. It's just like, I'm sorry, these are the instructions. Well, it's spicier if you don't do that, you're diluting it. It's like, oh my God, dude. I'm, I'm firmly uh, okay with my uh, my manliness, I guess that's what I'm supposed to be terrified of by following the instructions of not being manly enough. I mean, come on. Trust me, I've done Cully's World's Hottest Ramen 1 and 2. I, I, know, I know spicy. I know the pain. And it hurts. Okay. Now, this over here and get the amount just right. Uh, God, I wish it were easier to see. Uh, that's right on the nose. Okay, cool. So basically what will happen is once this is done, I'm going to drain that Add in the liquid, add in the sauce on the stove, make it boil, 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 and then add in the flakes, stir it a little bit, and that should do the trick. And then there will be a mukbang, and gosh, I, I hope it works out well because it is 15 minutes away from my wife's break time at work, and we always chat on her breaks, so. 
We'll see how it goes. I don't think it's gonna, I think I'm gonna have to, to cook this up and let it sit for a few minutes, honestly. All right, there we are. Take this off. Draining it. Adding it back in the pot. Adding in the water from the glug. Adding in the spicy fire bowl sauce. And then it wants you to do it like this for 30 seconds. So we'll just do it till it gets down to 30. Come on. Seems reasonable meat to me, and then it says to put this in, which I'm guessing the flake sachet is going to be your standard bulldog-y kind of stuff. It's just going to be seaweed and sesame seed, right? Is it? Is it? Yeah. This has got to be by the same guys that do the bull run. I don't know. Seems reasonable. Oh, oh, okay. like a deal a thing it smells beefy well, why don't you try it jerk well I can't because I'm doing a mukbang I gotta eat the whole thing I don't know it almost seems like a pointless endeavor because if this is that same stuff I'm gonna be very disappointed Gazoon tight out there Oh, you can kind of see it. Watch the delay. It's actually doing good right now. That's my monitor right there. But yeah, see? Sometimes it really, 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 really is way behind. But anyways. Yeah. For me, you know, I'm tempted just to do it right now, but in 10 minutes, this stuff's freaking hot, so we'll see how it goes. I'll probably do it in a little bit. Anyways, this has been Hans the Ramen Raider wishing you enjoyment of your noodles each and every day. Have a good one. Bye-bye.